pretty common one. Uh, that is water under the bridge. Water under the bridge. Any guess what that is? Water under the bridge. Well, it's um, maybe I think it's um, how can I say? Well, it's just. Um, Maybe there's a similar expression in Korean, water under the bridge. Well, in the, for the English expression anyway, uh, you can say water under the bridge is like an experience um, that happened in the past and it's not affecting the future, so you should not worry about it. Oh. Kind of like the past is the past and oh, you, sh you should not worry about the oh, okay. past thing. Like Kind of like let it go, right, right. Um, so if a friend is like... <laughs> I was wrong. <laughs> oh. <laughs> yeah, actually, I... Yeah, it's kind of a common one, but not that common, so... Um, it's kind of like, yes, let it go. Mm -hmm. If someone keeps talking about the mistake they made in the past, and they keep apologizing and saying, oh, I'm so sorry about that, I'm so sorry about that. You can tell them, oh, it's water under the bridge, really. It means just don't worry about it. We can't change what happened. And so I was guessing, like, matter of course. Matter of course. Uh, there is water under the bridge always. Okay, yeah, that was... <laughs> <laughs> okay, I can see why. Yeah. I guess some people say water over the dam, but way more common to hear water under the bridge in that situation. So the next time someone is bringing up a problem in the past, you can tell them, you know, that's water under the bridge, don't worry about that. That happened so long ago. We can't change what happened. So that's water under the bridge.